changes to your lifestyle by becoming more active. As we talk about your goal, please press the button on my head within the blue lights to say that you're finished talking. Let's try that now. Press the button on my head. Very good. Take your time to answer the questions. The more you work on them, the more you can get out of this session. During this interview, sometimes I may ask you questions that you think you've already answered. If that happens, I suggest you use it as an opportunity to think about the issue a bit more. Let's get started. You've been thinking about increasing your physical activity. If you became more physically active, how will that affect other areas in your life? Well, I think I'd be happier. I'd be more energetic. It'd help me sleep more. Um, I think also it'd fill up my free time and I'd start enjoying it much more. Let's talk about the downsides of your current level of activity. What is making you feel dissatisfied with it? So I'm not doing much exercise at the moment. It's mostly just walking to and from where I'm going to. Um, and I notice that sometimes I get out of breath or that I can't walk as far as I used to or I can't run as far as I used to. So that's what's making me unhappy. Does that worry or concern you? Why? Yeah, it does concern me because obviously we should all look um, to increase our physical activity so that we are more healthy in later life or in our current life. Is there anything that would get better if you increased your physical activity? So when I increase my physical activity, I think I'll see more muscle tone in my legs and I can walk further distances and do more activities. And then when I'm with my friends or my family, walking my dog, I won't feel as if I'm falling behind. How would that affect you? Um, so I'll be more confident when I go out and when I'm walking my dog, I can walk him for longer distances or run along with him so that he gets more exercise. Try summarizing the things that are likely to change for the better if you become more active. <clears throat> so when I become more active, I'll feel more energetic, I'll sleep better, I'll have more things to do with my free time and I can use that to do physical activity with my friends or family or my dog, which I think would increase my um, life satisfaction. Would you notice any changes after you did it for a month? Yeah, definitely. I think obviously I'd feel better when I'm doing exercise. I won't feel so tired. Um, I might lose a bit of weight and I think I'll find more enjoyment in it. Is there anything else you might notice? Um, no, just um, increasing physical health. Um, it might, might trigger me to eat better because I'm more noticing what the benefits are of physical exercise and want, want to offset that with eating junk food. What about after the first week? What early changes would you notice? Um, so maybe not any physical changes, but I might feel better about myself that I've tried something new. It'd give me more confidence to carry on. What have you been thinking about doing to increase your physical activity? So more long walks. There's a lot of Plymouth I haven't explored yet. I could start jogging as well. My brother started jogging so I could jog alongside him. I might also join the gym um, so I could use some of the machines there. Okay, so thinking about all the things that may get better if you were more physically active, which is the most important one to you right now? I think the most important thing would be to feel a bit better in my health. So increasing my activity would make me feel like I'm not struggling so much when I do exercise. Why is that important to you now? <clears throat> so that later on in life I'm not really far behind and I can't do anything and then I'm not really unfit now, I would feel better. So, in thinking about all this, what physical activity goal might help you get these positive changes? Um, so I would start with a goal of walking three times a week, maybe four times a week. 
um, along the hoe or maybe a bit further. I could do that with my boyfriend. He likes to walk as well. Um, I could also plan to join a gym and I could start maybe twice a week there um, before or after uni. How confident are you that you can do that for at least a week? Give it a percentage rating from zero, definitely cannot do it, to 100%. Sure, you can. About 90% sure. I go on a lot of walking anyway because we walk to the shop and then we might have a wander around. So I'm very confident that we could just plan to walk further. Let's make your plan even more concrete. Tell me again what exactly you want to do and how often you will do it. When would you like to get started? I could get started today, definitely. I could go home and talk to my boyfriend about planning a walk. Maybe we could go further than the hoe or we could walk past the aquarium and carry on that way. And we could do that three or four times a week. What would you need to do to get ready for that? I wouldn't need to do anything to get ready, I could just do that right away. Are there other things you could do now to help you get started? Um, I could just plan a walk on my phone. I can see where there are interesting places on Google Maps and I can see if I wanted to explore that. Is there anyone who could help you over the next week? Yeah, my boyfriend can help me. He likes to walk and he walks a lot faster than me, so he encourages me to go quicker. How confident are you now that you could do the activity for at least a week on the scale from zero definitely cannot do it to 100% sure you can? Yeah, 100% sure I could give it a go for a week. Did that increase from the first time? Just thinking about how you get started and how you did it in the past can make you feel more confident. Yeah, that did increase in confidence. What strategies did you use in the past to help you be more physically active? So in the past I did some jogging and I would map how far I jogged and for how long and then it would kind of compute how good that was, like um, it would show how many calories you burned and that's what I used to do. Could you use any of them now? Yeah, definitely. I could get the app back on my phone. I've also got a, a Fitbit, which also shows you how many calories you've burned throughout the day. It gives you a really good measure of how well you're doing. Okay, so far. You've told me about all the things that will change for the better if you become more active. You've remembered times you've been successful in the past and how you've done that. And you've worked through a detailed plan to get started. Let's review that out loud. So my plan would be to maybe use my Fitbit or my apps again and then I can go on walks with my boyfriend um, three or four times a week. Tell me what you want to do and when you're going to do it in one sentence. I'm going to plan a walk. <clears throat> I'm going to get my boyfriend to join me. Um, we're going to do a walk and then using the Fitbit tracker we can see how well we did and then we can work towards increasing our distance. Why are you doing it? What is the most important improvement that you'll see? I'll see a general increase in physical fitness and that'll make me feel better about myself and I'll be able to do more things. You don't have to be 100% confident to get started. You just need enough confidence to take the first step. Give it a go. How do you know that you'll succeed in getting started? I'm confident that I can get started. I know that I don't have to add anything. I don't have to buy anything or use anything that I don't already have to take the first step. So I'm very confident I can do that. That's great. Sounds like you're just about ready. When you think about getting started, what might get in the way and make that harder? So maybe if I've got other things planned or if I didn't have a good night's sleep, so I didn't feel like doing the exercise. What would you do about that? I would try to overcome that. Um, walking is not very hard. Um, it would just um, <clears throat> be to go on a walk and just keep walking until I've had enough of it and hopefully I would have done a really good distance. Congratulations! 
It sounds like you've really got a plan. I suggest you write down what you are going to do and why, so you can read over that during the week. All the best with getting started.